Welcome to the show buzz with our eye on what's new at the movies. This weekend, the gloves come off as top contenders vie for a coveted Golden Globe Award. Generating the most buzz is a race for best picture. Tom Hooper's The King's Speech seems like a virtual shoe-in for top honors, but giving it some tough competition is David Fincher's A Social Network and the late contender Black Swan rising in popularity. Starring newly engaged and pregnant Natalie Portman, she plays a ballerina consumed by dance. Also nominated, Christopher Nolan's Mindbender Inception and The Fighter starring Mark Wahlberg. The competition's tough, but my gut tells me the King's speech will clean up. Colin Firth is exceptional as a British monarch suffering a speech impediment, and he made a huge impact last year in a single man. So my odds on favorite, Firth and the film to pick up wins. Jesse Eisenberg, however, gives Firth a run for his money as a socially inept boy genius Mark Zuckerberg in The Social Network. Clever dialogue and Aaron Sorkin's razor-sharp script contrast sharply with Firth's British stammer, and it'll be interesting to see who comes out on top. Also buzzing is James Franco in 127 Hours. Based on a true story, he plays a mountain climber who displays unparalleled courage. Equally inspiring is Mark Wahlberg in The Fighter. He plays a rising boxer who must find the courage to break away from his brother. In the Best Actress category, Natalie Portman seems destined to make it her year with The Black Swan. But also getting attention is Halle Berry in Frankie and Alice, and Jennifer Lawrence as a 17-year-old out to track down her wayward father in Winter's Bone. Nicole Kidman also makes a list, pulling out a strong performance in Rabbit Hole, as does Michelle Williams for Blue Valentine, a film that hasn't yet received as much buzz as some of its competition. Best Director looks like a three-way race between Darren Aronofsky for The Black Swan, David Fincher for The Social Network, and Tom Hooper for The King's Speech. This is probably one of the toughest categories to predict this year, so your guess is as good as mine who will be victorious. One thing that is certain, Robert De Niro will be honored as this year's recipient of the prestigious Cecil B. DeMille Award, recognizing his outstanding contribution to the world of entertainment. And you can catch the Globes this Sunday, hosted once again by funny man Ricky Gervais. And of course, stay with CBSNews.com for all the latest pre- and post-show buzz. In New York, I'm Karina Mitchell.